Okay, moving on. Hide behind the tree. All else fails. Hide behind the tree. Pick up this. That's why we're going to chill in here, are we? Look at this. <laughs> we're shielded and we're just going to kind of destroy it. Yeah, I'm just going to destroy it. It's nice and slow, nice and easy. Wow, it's going to take a lot of batteries, this. It certainly can't fit in here, so... Boom! There is another one. Yeah. That's fine, though. Anytime you're ready, Alan. There we go. I'll leave those things flying around there. Hey, flare gun ammo, nice. Oh. Anything outside of riding is a struggle. I feel ill. I managed to make my way downstairs. There's a shoebox filled with books and papers by Thomas Zane. It's very hard to focus, but I managed to read some of it. He's a poet, and a good one. He writes of muses and creators summoning fabulous things from a magic lake, using his powers to shape the world of a realm of gods and dreams and demons, dark things that wait for a chance to slip through, wearing the flesh of men as disguise. Zane writes about himself, his girlfriend being taken over by a dark presence, about growing scared of the lake. Zane believes it's a mirror to the gaping void of darkness above, where some Lovecraftian presence lurks. I crawl back upstairs, I'll borrow these things from my story. They ring true. They fit. Interesting. I find it, there's something really eerie about the way that Alan Wake in the TV screen looks at the camera and is obviously freaking out a bit. I don't know, it's just something quite eerie about that. Hey, hunting rifle. Mm, do you know, I actually prefer my shotgun. <laughs> uh... Yeah, more bullets um, for it, I think, possibly. Um, pick up batteries. We can't pick up any more batteries, so. Moving on. Do you know, I'll be, I'll be really peed off if it's just Bigfoot in the forest there, you know? That'd be so disappointing. Okay, anyway, up these ladders. Okay, creaky. That was creaky, not creepy. How are we doing for stuff? We've got three of them. 16 of them. And uh, three of them. And uh, 12 revolver only. Hmm. Something over here. The kidnapper had sent me a text. The message was full of spelling errors and insults. It was telling me to hurry up. I'll got my own pace, dude. I'll got my own pace, thank you. You've been very demanding, and the very least I can do is to take my time. That was like the easiest hidden item set there that we've come across probably. Anyway. What's up here for us? That's the question. Checkpoint received. Oh, reached. I keep saying received. Birds. Oh, yes. Whoa! Oh, 
Don't have to make a run for it. Stay away. I wasn't sure if I was supposed to go in there, but we got away from the birds at least. Now I can tell you now, this is almost to the point of as far as I've I've been before. Nothing this way. Oh, I don't know why I thought there was a hole, and I thought I was gonna fall down. Nothing to search for here, so we're down here, are we? Okay, that's creepy. Tunnel, tunnels go to Cauldron Lake. Can you hear the whisper, guys? It's like it's... Okay, I'm just going to keep moving because that is creepy as hell. Without warning, the headache stabbed at my brain. Okay. That was really random. I thought it was going to be game over for a minute then. Sounds like it's coming from down here. Ugh. I'm losing it. I gotta get out of here. Oh, nice manuscript. So it looks like there's a dead end here, but we never came here for no reason. At least there's a manuscript page there, though. All right. Oh, I don't like caves at all, especially like this. I wish it was a stamina bar though. That'd be that'd be really helpful and not really game breaking or game changing. I suppose the no stamina bar kind of adds a bit more challenge to the game. I mean, your health is at the top left, that little red bar there. The the yellow dot is your sort of destination or where you should be heading. And then obviously that's your torture of your ammo, but that's pretty much it. Torch and your ammo. <coughs> torch and the batteries. And the top right inside is your uh, weapon and ammo. Oh, I see you. Flare, flare, and flare. Hey, okay. Boop. Before we go further down, we can see there is a money soup there and some stuff to pick up here. Uh, and the way down there, maybe looks by the looks of it. Manuscript page, so nice. Looks like a way out. I remember what's going to happen here. Hello! <laughs> nice! Got rid of them in two. That was it. Now I remember actually struggling on that before from my previous, you know, non published recording. Because you had the big guy here coming through, and he was one of those ones that take a good while to go down. And then you got three other enemies that come in at you there. So I just figured throw a grenade here and there. Boom, done. Got one spare now. Actually, we're getting quite low in revolver ammo now. So now I wish I was conserving my ammo like earlier. But then I was struggling earlier, so... Okay, 
Okay, we've got left and right. I'll have a quick look to the right. Nothing there. Okay, well that was a waste. I always feel better for checking though. I always feel better for checking. Otherwise I'll be always thinking, I wonder what was down that section that we never checked. Nothing there. Oh, okay then. Checkpoint reach, nice. Way up this mine shaft in order to go on. Maybe the machinery could help me with that. Well, quite obviously, I think it will. So first, we can use this. Yep. Okay, so that was that across there. And I'm hoping, I think there was another switch that we can call it up. Yes, look, here. Just going to check there's no bullets or anything. No. Is that high enough? Maybe not quite high enough. Go with that. I know it's. Oof. Oh, I thought it was going to fall then. Okay, good. And I think we're going to need to press this again so that we can cross up there. Like so. And I think. This is a. <coughs> excuse me, this is going off memory. We climb up the ladder here. Damn. <laughs> Damn. I've gone too far, haven't I? We need to straighten that out so we can actually go across there by looks, I think. Yeah, like that. Okay, now we can go up the ladder. There. Yes, okay. Oh, oh, oh my god. <clears throat> Why did I even jump then? Why? Why? Uh, <laughs> ah, okay. I get it now. I get it. Now, if I'm right. Go. Should I jump down here? If we go down here. Where did those ladders go to though? Those other ladders. Oh, there they are. Found them. Yes, okay, so if we if we press this to bring this back up here once again. Oh, it looks like it should be fairly level. Then, rather than getting back up the other way, we go this way up. I think. I hope that's right. Yeah. That's spot on that. Just make sure there's nothing else to pick up before we move any further. Nah. That was a kind of mini puzzle. But they're the puzzles I do like. Ones that I can solve. Quick and easy. Can I kick this down? Yes. Okay, now up or down. That's what she said. Uh, I'm going to go up this time. I want to see what's up here first. If anything. Looks like there's going to be something here. One, two, three. At the very least, we've got some flares. And a manuscript page. Nice. 
That was a good decision, that. That wasn't a good decision, though. <laughs> okay, I just climbed on the box, whatever. Okay, now I, I assume I can go down the stairs and hopefully continue on. Reach the Mirror Peak Lookout. That's where we're headed now. Goddamn birds were waiting for me. Oh, nice. I should destroy them birds. Two, three. I don't know what that does. Ah, nice. Hopefully those birds have gone now that I've activated that. Oh. I'm just going to make sure there's nothing else to pick up here. No ledges with anything. No, that's fine. That's all good. Pick up batteries. Am I full on batteries? I am full on batteries. Nice. Still quite low-ish on the revolver ammo. Just going to make sure everything's reloaded. Yeah. Seven flares though, that's decent. But only one grenade. Oh my god. Where are they? Where did they go? There they are. <clears throat> I got rid of the other birds, so it's just these ones to go. And we're almost there. Damn, I lost them. Uh, no. Please, no. Oh. 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 Jump. Well, we lived. We made it across. Nice. That's one guy. Nice, that was hassle free that. We're getting close. Whoa! Okay then. Shit. Yeah. Yeah, Schmidt. So anything here? Oh that's where we would have been. How tempted am I to just knock them off? Um, that's where we would have ended up, I suppose. 